Friends and family of five safe tonight after escaping a fire in their home early this morning. Firefighters saying that two adults and three kids are all in the hospital tonight with non life threatening injuries after jumping from a second story window. Michael Tater spoke to the woman who dialed 911 about the father's quick action to save his family. I saw him, the fire come out that bottom window over there. It's just shooting out flames and then he's screaming, help me, help me, there's a fire. This Toledo woman says she woke up before the sun this morning to see a different bright light. There were flames shooting out of her neighbor's upstairs window. She immediately called 911. They got here real quick. Within, I think, the first couple of minutes they were here. Firefighters say it was the mother and father who made it out with two of their young boys through the second floor window. But the neighbor says there was a third child still inside, and she saw the father grab a ladder and go back in. I seen him go up the ladder and go back up in the window, and then fall. I seen him fall down from the porch with his son. Neighbors are calling him a hero tonight. They say he did all of this even though he was recovering from a car accident. He uh, had just before that got into an accident about uh, like like a month ago. Neighbors we talked to say he did what he had to do as a father and a husband to save his family. Him being a dad, like just dad yeah, kicked in. Dad instinct, you know. It just, it just took over the father, you know, as my, his kid. Those neighbors are glad the family is okay, saying they're good people. The fire did heavy damage to the first floor, and tonight investigators are still looking into what started it. In South Toledo, Michael Tater, WTOL 11. Now we do need to mention the family's home did not have working smoke detectors. Sterling Ray from TFD saying that most fire deaths occur from smoke inhalation and not necessarily from flames. So he says smoke detectors are critical in giving people more time to get out safely.